Hey everyone, and welcome to another episode of Monkey Around Reviews. Today we have the Sassoon, or the CZHOON, USB C hub adapter. It has multiple USB 3 ports, an HDMI port, and a charging port. So let's go ahead and open this up and see what's inside of it. So when you open up the box, it comes with a instruction manual here, which I don't really know how much of this you're going to need since it's pretty much plug and play. And we pull this out and we have the hub. So we got USB-C here. On this side, we have the three USB-3 ports, full size. You have a HDMI port over here. And then over here, you have the charging port. So you can plug this into your computer and you can uh, plug the power cable over here to still charge it. Now, what I want to do is something a little different. We know this works with computers, but how good does this work with phones? Well, I have an LG V30 phone right here, and it is USB-C. So what my plan is, is I'm going to plug this into the USB-C port, and then I'm going to take a mouse, and we're going to see if this works. So I just plugged in right now, and the screen came on, and it says, uh, tap to change USB options. So it looks like this thing's going to work. So I'm going to bring the camera in, we're going to look at the screen, and hopefully we're going to see a mouse pop up on the screen that we'll be able to move around by just plugging one into here. So stand by, I'll be right back. So as you can see, I've got my phone open here just on a regular Google search page. I got the CZ Hoon USB adapter, and I got my USB mouse right over here. So we're just going to take the USB connection and we're going to plug it in. The light has come on the mouse and it said mouse was uh, detected. And I can already see my mouse arrow on there. I don't know if it's showing up on here or not. Let me try to turn the phone over here a little bit. There we go. And right over by the E of Google, you'll see the mouse. There it is, right over here. So that is the USB mouse plugged in through the CZ Hoon USB adapter and it's putting a mouse control right on my phone. So if I go down to the search bar here and I left click, it's selecting it which brings up the keyboard. And then if I go in here and I can click like five and six and you can see that it's actually selecting them. There's the Y. It's kind of hard for me to do since I'm looking down at this. And if I hit the right click button, it seems to take it back. So I'm guessing the right click is the, uh, the, the back button like there is on uh, your phone already. So your left click is the select and your right click seems to be the back button. But most importantly, there is a mouse. So if you have something where you need a mouse to control, this will do it. Uh, my next thing is I'm going to take this and plug it into the TV and see if the HDMI port on here actually outputs to the television as well. So uh, let's go to the next room and see what happens. Be right back. All right, so we got the phone here next to the TV. I've got the CZ Hoon USB adapter plugged into the phone, and I've got my HDMI right here, the cable, and I'm gonna plug it in. As soon as I plug it in, it says connected to secondary screen, and there you go. You've got the phone right here on the TV. I can tilt the phone and rotate it, and now we're full screen. As you can see, we've got the Monkey Around Reviews page up. If we go to a video right over here and we hit play, it's gonna play here on the TV. And the audio is coming through it as well. So the HDMI down here is actually taking the video and the audio from the phone into the adapter through the HDMI cable right into the TV. So as we saw, it's playing nicely and it's sounding good all through this adapter. So this right here is a very affordable way to be able to get whatever's on your phone onto your TV without having to uh, stream it or do it wirelessly. It's a hard wire plug coming right out of the HDMI, or right, excuse me, right out of the USB-C adapter here through the HDMI. And with this adapter, you can still charge your phone while you're doing this, you're not eating up your battery life if you're wanting to watch something on here for a long time. So I'm just gonna hit play again. So once again, you can see that the video and the audio are coming through nice, clear, and crisp. And you can see I hit pause here, it paused it there. 
So there is no delay between what's going on. This is creating a true secondary mirrored display from your phone through the HDMI cable. So all in all, I've been very happy with the CZ Hoon USB adapter. It's done everything and more than what I was expecting. Now obviously on a computer, I knew this was going to work because that's what it's made for. Uh, when I plugged it into the cell phone, I was pretty sure that the mouse was going to work because the cell phone have had mouse drivers for a very long time in there, uh, but it, it worked instantly. And then when I went ahead and tested out the HDMI port, that blew my mind. I mean, I would, thought it was gonna work, but I really wasn't sure. And then I was like, oh, I wonder if the audio is gonna go passing through it. And it worked flawlessly. It was smooth. There was no digital pixelation coming from it when it was trying to play like you get sometimes through wireless. I mean, it really worked. And I like this feature right here where you can charge on this side. So you can plug this in, USB-C, charge USB-C, go HDMI out to your television or to another monitor, and it's not going to waste your phone's battery life if you happen to be playing something on the monitor from your phone, just so you can see it on that bigger screen. You don't have to worry about that battery running out on you. So for the price of what this is, this does a lot. I'm very happy with it, I'm very impressed, and I, I would recommend this for anyone that needs a hub on their laptop or some way to get video from their phone onto the TV. Um, once again, I have a LG V30, so that is what this has been tested on and works as you saw. So your phone may or may not work with this, but obviously there's one way to find out. So if you get one of these to work on your phone, Please comment so below so other people will know what phones that these work with. And if you have any questions, please make sure you ask those below as well. And as always, make sure you subscribe. Hmm?